everyone, Claire here from Raw Blend. Today I'm going to show you what stone fruit does when you dehydrate it. Uh, it's not really a recipe, it's more so for those who've been asking to see dehydrated nectarines, dehydrated apricots and whatever stone fruit you have that's just about to turn. So today I'm going to be using this Sedona Combo Dehydrator. I love it because it looks good. Um, we've got the stainless steel options, but we've also got the TST function and the dual fan technology. So dual fan technology, if you're not going to use the whole machine at once, you can just use the plastic divider tray we have in here and either use the top or the bottom fan. So you're saving power and that's always a plus. So I'm just going to get started. I've got a mixture of yellow flesh and white flesh nectarines. I've got the end product in here, so I'll show you that when we get to it. Um, but I'm going to put some lemon juice on top. This will save the colour uh, and make it look pretty once it's done. But also I find it really does bring out the taste in your fruit. Alright, and it's as simple as that. Feel free to add in any spices that you want, but this is merely a video to show you what happens? Because we have some quite chunky pieces of nectarine, what we want to do is dehydrate at a higher temperature and then bring it down so we get out most of the moisture in your fruit. This is to save any bacteria or mold forming and don't worry about enzymes because only when the fruit is bone dry will it actually hit the temperature of your machine. So what I did was I chose the fast and the raw mode, which is the TST function, which we love so much. So we can set that in either Fahrenheit or Celsius. And then we set it to, I started with 65 for about four hours. And then after four hours, I want it at around 55, for let's just say 13 and then it'll show you which one it starts at and let's press start. As you can hear it is still whisper quiet. We've already done the dehydration process so what I want to do is show you the end product. A few of these could go for a bit longer. The smell is gorgeous, so you could always add in some cinnamon or some nutmeg, depending on what spices you like. Happy dehydrating, everyone. <laughs> 